Nerd Rage vs Misfits Academy. Right from the word go, Nerd Rage came out with an off the wall strategy to try and topple the favourites. With three smites across the board due to unsealed spellbook, KVO had an incredibly fast start on Zack. Unfortunately though, it was not enough to stop a flick from controlling the early game on Nidalee, and after stealing most of the enemy jungle, he managed to grab himself first blood up top. Moment, particularly if Governor goes to oh, a flick just pounces on that and he becomes a scratching pose for the Nidalee. A flick headed to the top lane for another repeat gank, but wasn't quite as successful as the first time around. After a beautiful kill, Grosvenor unfortunately overstepped himself and turned it into a one for one. Such a well played move there, a little bit greedy from Misfits and they get punished. Yeah, Flick thought he could go in. Actually, oh, as I say, no, Governor! Oh, Governor, why? Just not needed to go in. As on the that. teams hit the mid game, fights started to get much messier. But Misfits were still able to come out on top. For the Zoe in the backside as Crossfire joins the fight. Tam Kench coming in off the backside as well. Does cancel it though, just in case. And now the side of Nerd Rage are in a lot of hurt. They're in a lot of trouble. There is a flick. Gonna eventually get the smite off. He will oh, not he's still alive. Alive. He will not die. With all that confidence and momentum, Misfits overcommitted to a play for the bottom tower getting punished heavily. Oh, to Chrisberg, but it's just not enough. Crossfire does get a nice ultimate off. There's the stopwatch from Chrisberg. He goes golden as the rest of Misfits just keep Jackamaka away. Now Crogson is here, but he's a little bit late to the party. He flashes in, has the ghost to be able to put down damage. Afflict might be in a little bit of trouble. He will fall. Crossfire will follow him in the aftermath as well as Nerd Rage finally get themselves some gold and some kills. Despite the deaths though, Special was still rocking Nerd Rage's world as he rinsed the team's tanks. There it is, like, why Zoe is stupid. And it's just not okay. It's not, okay? <laughs> That's the tank as well, like, come on. Oh my oh. god. Special, please. They have families. In the later stages of the game, the gold lead was so huge for Misfits that a tiny misstep lost the fight for Nerd Rage. Down by Chris Berg and an already botched engage. Gonna see all the ultimates used. Sleep put on the Snuggly. He's gonna be forced to use that Grey Held as Shikari now rejoins the fight. It's a double kill for Chris Berg. Maybe a triple kill. No, Zoe gonna deny him. And that's gonna be the rest of Nerd Rage just backing away. Nerd Rage made one last attempt at fighting, but Misfits overpowered them once again. And after taking the fight, they take two inhibitors broken down and you can see how much damage this Zoe and this triple crit item Tristana is doing. So much potential from Miss or from Misfits coming out from this comp and then they can rotate straight away to that mid lane. With a devastating gnarl, Misfits Academy close out the game. This might be the moment for it, but unfortunately Shikari shuts down everything. They get a kill, but it ends up being a three for one trade. No damage left on the side of Nerd Rage, and this is going to be the game.